Why am I dressed like a magician? Because we want to get our students excited about learning. When they are excited to learn, they remember what they have to learn. How do we do that? Here is an acronym that might help. R-A-P We teach through activities that are relevant, appealing and personal for our students. When we do this, the result is a class that enjoys learning. And when students enjoy learning, learning sticks. Hi, I'm Dr. Nazir. Let me show you what I mean through this magic trick that I use to teach density in a secondary one class. I put on my magic cape and whipped out my magic cup. I asked for a volunteer in class to check that the cup was empty. I poured water into the cup. Then, I inverted the cup over the head of my volunteer. My students cried out in surprise. Was my volunteer drenched? No! Where did the water go? I invited my volunteer to look into the cup and he exclaimed that it was empty. I inverted the cup back again. Then I poured water back into the jar. My students were amazed. The magic is in the science. It's all about density. I revealed the secret behind the magic trick. I had placed a circular piece of transparent acrylic into the cup. Acrylic has a higher density than water. So when the cup was inverted, the acrylic piece sank down and sealed the hole, preventing the water from pouring out. Why did I perform this magic trick in class? I wanted my students to be excited and intrigued to explore the science behind the magic cup instead of just reading about density in a textbook. The students then made their own magic cups at the Design and Technology Laboratory. They explored using different materials, understanding how some materials float or sink and how that affects the magic trick. Several students also experimented with different thickness of acrylic pieces to see how different densities of plastic affects the trick. This gave them a deeper understanding of the topic. Through this experience, students connected emotionally with the subject matter in a joyful manner. With this approach to teaching and learning, I believe my students will recall with fondness the experience of learning density and remember the experience for years to come.